So this week I thought I'd show you an exercise that I put together a while ago. Uh, I came up with this because I was interested in guitarists who were introducing rhythm into their playing. So they weren't just playing straight 16th notes, but they'd use some syncopation in there as well. So players like Aldi Miola, he's a great example of someone who, who really has mastered this, this concept of syncopation in the playing. Uh, now I was really struggling with it, which was why I came up with this exercise. And I've attached a PDF to the description field. So you should download that because that, that really does help if you want to give it a go yourself. And I'll play it through at the end as well, um, just show you what I can do these days. I've not played it for a while, so I might be a bit uh, ropey, but there you go. Um, but what I'm doing is I'm up on the... I'm up on the 10th fret in G major. That three notes per string shape there. And what I'm doing is I'm playing in groups of three, I'm playing with a triplet field. But instead of just playing straight triplets like that, I'm starting, I introduce 16th notes on different places of the beat throughout the phrase. So for example, the first couple of bars are this. So what I'm doing there is the first phrase, straight eighth notes, second phrase I go one and two, three. So you can hear I've introduced that, that sixteenth note between the first and the second note. And then the, the third one is one, two and three. And then the fourth one is this, one, two, three and for staying key. And then I cycle through working my way up and down. It's one of those exercises that really you really gain something if you're playing with a metronome as well because that allows you to to establish the beat and that's that's the largest part of the battle is is making sure that all of your notes line up perfectly on the beat. Um, but as I say have a go at it and see how you get on and we'll chat next time. Goodbye.